It's Mike J. Laneside. I've worked in professional bowling for 15, 20 years, uh, working for PBA Digital. It's Rachel Lindsay, and the qualifying factor is Marquette University undergrad, PA announcer for the Golden Eagles, law school, law school. graduate. Yes. Tell me about your law school experience. Well, I went 2008 to 2011 which was a great year because they went to the Elite Eight that year in basketball. I loved Marquette. I went to the campus, fell in love with Milwaukee, fell in love with Marquette, coming from the University of Texas. I'm one of the smaller experiences. Like um, we were in the law school, the old law school, the first two years. My last year, we were in the new one, which is amazing. Um, but I love everything about it. I still come back to Marquette once. COVID's made it a little harder, but once or twice a year, I come back. I speak to the students. You know, I'm a Longhorn at heart, but I'm also a Golden Eagle as well. Yeah. <laughs> scratch, scratch, scratch. <laughs> Tough transition. Bowling, getting ready to bowl. Sadly. Good bowling yes. story. Everyone's got a bowling story. Honestly, that's I don't because it's been that long. My bowling story is that I haven't bowled in this decade. It's been I don't I think single digits. I want to say maybe on some uh, on a bad day. Maybe that's why it's out of my mind. At this point. But what I'm hoping for is because it's been such a long time. Beginner's luck right here. That's what I'm rooting for. They asked me if I wanted to practice. I said no. I want to go in pure beginner's luck. <laughs> no practice. That's good. Before all the bad habits. Supporting the uh, CP3 uh, Foundation. Chris Paul among the league leaders in giving back. And important to, to, to be here while we're having fun. Uh, no, I absolutely. I'm so happy to be here to support the Chris Paul Family Foundation. Chris Paul does so many things in the community. Not just one thing. Uh, like most recently with HBCUs and what he's doing in a partnership with UBS and financial services. So I'm just happy to be here. And I think also because of everything that we've been going through with COVID, I feel like there's so much attention that's been given, and rightfully so, to what we're going through with COVID and the pandemic. But then there are also so many other organizations and charities that still need our support. So I'm so happy to be here tonight with you. What's your strike celebration going to be? <laughs> it's really not out. <laughs> That's how you know there are going to be no oh, strikes tonight. Billy White Shoes Johnson. <laughs> That's right. The slow mo. Billy White Shoes. <laughs> Don't miss it. CP3 on Fox Sunday, October 17th. We'll see you on the lanes. <laughs> see you there.